hey girlies your girl is back welcome to the channel if you're new welcome today you guys we have a curly unit from west kiss hair look at how it came i feel like i didn't have to do much but they have this elastic band they have everything that you need to get a really bomb install you guys already know your girl is really extra so i did have to do some extra plucking but look at how juicy these curls are i'm going to show you basically how to get these curls popping so this is me pre-plucking it myself so it can have a little bit more gradient effect especially when i pop it on as you can see it's looking a little bit more realistic for my liking so i went ahead and prepped my elastic band because you already know it's about to be that time to melt this lace so i used a new product today you guys this is this ors spritz gel stuff and i really did like how it dried pretty fast and got tacky like it was supposed to it said wait 90 seconds i waited exactly 90 seconds and it was tacky and it was tacky but what i didn't like was the fact that it lifted so easy I ended up going with my got to be glue hairspray after I realized that this wasn't, you know, it wasn't given as much safety as I needed. As you guys can see, the curl pattern is so nice on this hair, but I wanted to comb the hair out completely because I wanted to shape it. I wanted to give a little bit more volume to the curls and a little bit more life. And I wanted to try out this new product. So as you can see, your girls look like Diana. Okay, and I'm not mad at it. I used to be obsessed with doing my hair like this. And now I'm going to take my scissors and just shape the hair. I'm not using shears, girl. I'm just using regular scissors. And it got the job done. So this is how it looks after shaping. And now I'm going to go to the other side and do the same thing until I get, like, the density that I'm looking for. I just want to kind of get the, get rid of the dead ends, but also give me some, like, you know, volume to the curly unit. And it's, a, like, a night and day, a night and day experience with your units if you do do this so after we finish shaping it's time to just drench the hair with plain old water nothing I'm, I'm not using any product yet i just want you guys to see how juicy and luscious these curls are without using any product i actually put a little bit of shine spray in it just so i can go ahead and like enhance like the shine just a little bit and it helps make the hair smell it really really good i use the pattern beauty shine spray and this is basically what it looks like as you can see the hair looks a little bit more dense it looks a little bit more you know it has that volume in it and I feel like it just makes the curls look popping. So I gave you guys some slow-mo so you guys can see it. This is a 24-inch unit, so I pretty much cut maybe like two inches off of it. So I was really here for the results, okay? Oh, and as you can see, I'm putting it up in a ponytail. It's so cute in a ponytail, you guys, like especially when it dries. So I use this Miss Jessie's Pillow Soft Curly pink lotion lotion however you want to call this actual product so this stuff smells really good it smells like a dryer sheet like some fresh linen it's not fruity or anything like that it does smell really fresh so if that's your vibe you'll definitely like this but not only does it smell good it actually does what it's supposed to do it defines your curls it still makes them look super fluffy soft it doesn't give that ramen noodle look to your hair it doesn't give that crunch to it and that's basically what it's advertised to do just make sure curls look very plump very voluptuous and just you know smells really good without any frizz and i was really happy to see the results first time using this product so i definitely give it a 10 out of 10 i actually used it on some wavy hair today and y'all when y'all see that video you're going to be in love so i advise you to pick it up it's from walgreens but yeah I'm just going to go ahead and remove this lace. As you can see, she's giving life. I'm so happy with this lace quality. This is their HD lace. I did have to tint this lace, you guys. I used my Ebony New York Lace Tint Mousse. It does look a little dark right here, but we're going to get that together. 
I think it was the lighting because it looked really, really natural towards the end of the video. But girl, West Kiss definitely did their big one with this unit. I am obsessed. I don't know if it was how I cut it. I don't know if it's because their curls are just perfect. I would love to know if you guys have ever worked with West Kiss hair. I love their curly units. You can never go wrong with one of their curly or their wavy units. Um, I just feel like they always provide really soft, good quality HD lace frontal wigs. So I'm always here to try out a new unit from this company. And I was really happy with this one. So I will link all the information down in the description box below so you guys can check it out. And as you can see, we making sure we get these baby hairs. One thing I was really happy about though is that this lace did exactly what it needed to do today i actually worked with some lace that i had to put my elastic band on probably four to five times before i actually left the house if i have to do that i'm not gonna let you know that that's some really good lace because no one has time for that you guys so as you can see this lace is melted melted so when they say hd quality lace you guys you definitely have to be careful because sometimes the hd can give the lace can give a higher quality but when it comes to laying it with your natural product or with your hairsprays or your glue it can be a little hassle but i was happy that west kiss provided high quality through and through from their hair to their lace so once again i will link all their information down below i love you guys so much and i will see you soon bye y'all i look good do you see it yes period <laughs>